has dropped here on campus where um, we travel every spring break to the Dominican Republic and we work with at-risk youth. Um, while we're in Dominican Republic, we, uh, we work with these kids that are, don't come from steady homes, live in the streets, uh, don't live in the safest neighborhoods, and all they do, what they do to survive is pretty much like they shoe shine. They stand in corners, they shoe shine, they, or they sell other goods, uh, maybe cell phone covers or anything, anything that they can do to sell money. Um, and pretty much when we're over there, we give them, we try to empower them through doing educational activities and also having fun. So we play board games and do scavenger hunts and speak about the environment and how to better um, the world around them and you know, to how to make it out of where they are. Um, these kids are awesome. They, uh, they've really impacted me and my life and the lives of others in this club. When I first went, like, well, when I first got involved, I thought it was like, oh, it's going to be a free trip to Dominican Republic, and then that quickly changed, and getting there, it was just, like, unbelievable. It's something where, like, you, I don't know, just can't imagine, I'm from Colombia, so over there, yes, there's poverty, there's poverty everywhere in this world, but a lot of times you see the poverty, and you, like, see it, you really don't take it in, so, like, I have seen kids like this, and families like this, and you just, like, see them. But you, I've never really interacted with them, so going on this trip and interacting with families and kids that are in this situation was like unbelievable. Um, I definitely had a different mind going into it than what I have now. I learned that la vie pa'u si toi pese. That means when life gives you lemons, squeeze it.